because you have the same kind of feeling for it. But um, longboarding right now is kind of like absolutely exploding. So it's really easy to just kind of go out with your friends, have a good time, and uh, that's kind of what I, how I started doing it. Um, you know, just getting together with your buddies and just going out and skating, and then just kind of started progressing from there. Started doing crazier and crazier stuff. Make and YouTube videos. Make sure you're yeah. yeah. YouTube videos. Make yeah. sponsored. Exactly. Getting sponsored by Original was one of the greatest things in my entire life so far, and they just been treating me really well, and you know, living the dream pretty much. <laughs> Does your company focus on uh, styling boards like this with you know art or hardcore riding boards? Or? Um, well, it's actually kind of split. Um, I mean, there's a really big uh, movement in longboarding. It's kind of like really traditional. So, I mean, you'll see a lot of boards that look like surfboards. Um, we make a lot of boards that do look like surfboards and kind of have that classic pintail type feel, um, like the ones you'll see with Jay's art on them. But we also make um, some pretty unique boards that are set up specifically for the type of longboarding that we're trying to do. Um, so that could be downhill. That could be um, freestyle flatland. Um, Really, it depends what you're trying to accomplish. Uh, and there's so much progression uh, progression going on with the riding that we're really trying to progress with our board designs at the same time. Um, so you'll see some pretty unique shapes if you uh, check out our line. And Jay, you've got the NART show as part of the Sam Jam weekend on Saturday at five, right? Uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. We have uh, some of my newer paintings with us, as well as some of the ones that people are more used to seeing and more. Uh, that have been out there a little longer. Uh, it should be a nice display. We also have a lot of art and merchandise for sale. And uh, like I mentioned earlier, I just got back from Brazil, so it's like coming off of one show in one con and going to another one. <coughs> so we're pretty stoked to be here. We're going to check out a band that you guys brought with you for uh, for the Sam Jam. Tell me about your friends here. Well, uh, Quincy Mumford Band, like I mentioned, are uh, some friends from back home in Jersey. They're an up-and-coming band is getting a lot of great opportunities. They're uh, actually all really young, too. They're all, uh, or most of them are in between 18 and 19 years old. Uh, but it's pretty incredible the following they built. They have a really unique sound, and it's real good, uh, real good acoustic vibe. It's Quincy Mumford Band, the Thursday morning uh, open mic 